Well, howdy folks, welcome back to my channel. I wanted to show off one of my latest creations from the garage today. It's right here, and it's a little bitty guitar amp, if you can see that. And if you just kind of look around real quick, it actually looks like something you might find in a store. Um, but this is really funny because what happened is over the weekend, my wife was going to a craft store to get some stuff for one of her projects. And she said, hey, do you want to come along? And I thought, yeah, why not? I always find cool stuff at a craft store. And I went in and they had this. This was actually, if you look at it like this, it was a, it was a bunch of boxes and they were unfinished boxes, wooden boxes that were made for like jewelry box kits. And they had like a whole pallet of them and they were four bucks. And so I was like, oh, I'll be able to make something out of that. And so I grabbed it and then I got home and I just did this with stuff that I had on hand. There was, this wasn't even like a project project, but I had one of these um, kits from Cigar Box Junction. If you've never seen these, these uh, DIY amp kits. And uh, I just put it together and you can see how all the, the uh, stuff goes in there. And then I had these rubber feet that I put on the bottom. This is just a uh, like a gate handle that I put on the top. And then these chicken head knobs here and some, uh, see if you can see that, there's like some uh, grating uh, in there to, between the speaker and the, and the box there. And I just cut a two and a half inch hole in it with a hole saw, drilled a couple holes here, um, basically drilled out all the holes, stained it, and then varnished it. And I tell you what, the varnish took a few hours to dry. That was the longest part of this whole process. I think the actual build of the amp probably took me about 15 minutes, literally, because it was just things I had around in the garage and I put it together. And uh, powered by a nine volt, you can probably see that on the back here. You can see there's two little screws come through here. But if you pop open the back, there's the little nine volt battery there. And um, input jack is here. So it goes input, gain, volume, and the speaker. Um, the speaker's not terribly loud because it is a little three inch speaker, but um, it's great for like just, you know, practicing or something. So I'm going to plug it in and uh, see what you guys think. And so there you have it. There's a little homemade amp, threw, threw it together in the garage in about 15 minutes. And like I said, other than the, <laughs> than the varnish drying, it really didn't take long at all. It was just stuff I had on hand and it'd be a nice little thing to have around. So if you like this video, why don't you go ahead and give it a thumbs up. And of course, if you like my content, I'd love it if you would subscribe. I'll see you guys in the next video.